after this season? Mm -hmm. Should the Lakers bring him back? I think so. I think he's unique. I think um, Luke has totally opened up this kid's game and the way he's using him. Mm -hmm. Playing him as a five is scary because he's strong enough to guard any center in the league. But there is not one center in this league that wants to have him coming downhill at him with that dribble and that power. Uh, he's one of the most unique scorers in the league right now. I think he's a matchup problem for any team. He is a Swiss Army Knife 5, and I yes. just love it. And I think he's going to keep getting better and better. We're both fans of Julius Randle. However, based on the process that the Lakers have established and they've sold to the public, unfortunately, they're going to lose a really good young player, Bees. A guy, as you mentioned, can play four and five, an improved shooter, can create better than people oh, really man. realize as well. He's had a couple of triple doubles in this league, but they've already sold the fact that we need two max contracts. Right. And they put it out there, and in order to make that happen, Julius Randle, unfortunately, right. has to be a casual. So there's no chance you could go back on that now. You can't. Too late. Even though, because you couldn't have predicted this, right? Right. You didn't know this was going to happen this That's what, with kids, you never know. And now you're starting to see this guy explode. Like I said, Luke deserves the credit because yep. he put this kid in a position that, me, that really highlights what he can do. And, uh, God, that would be a tough one to lose because I just feel like in today's NBA, he is like, He's like the ultimate like power player that could take advantage of switches, yep. all of the stuff that you need uh, to attack the best defenses. He brings it, so we'll see. But because you, you might lose him, and you're not guaranteed of who's coming. Correct. So, so that's why you didn't like when they talked so much. Correct. That, that strategy. But was. also, what you do is you give him ammunition because in his head, every time he hears two max contracts, it's like, oh, okay, they want me out of here. Right. So now he's played himself into the value. As you introduced this topic, you said the guy that's been the most consistent all season mm -hmm. on a squad that has the number two pick in ball and also had Kuzma who came out of nowhere and had a really good season. I like this story.